Warning. Although my content is usually family-friendly, Phoenix Wright Ace Attorney is a game that has been rated T by the ESRB rating system, and as such, will contain blood, language, suggestive themes, and violence. Viewer discretion is advised. Feral Phoenix Wright! Phoenix Wright! He's an Ace Attorney! That was bad dissonance, oh man. <laughs> we're, we're playing Phoenix Wright again today, everybody. Artie Marty, you're back. And I'm really happy and a little hyper because I just had some ice cream, so. Same, but I'm not hyper. I just had some ice cream. But I'm so, <laughs> we're, we're in the middle of the trial, first trial period for Turnabout oh, Goodbyes. A lot of hearts on the stand, y'all. Oh boy. I think this is, yeah, this is the testimony, <laughs> I believe. How Edgeworth was seen. Oh no, cross examination. You're right, it was a cold night and the mist was thick as grits. I like how we can just get right into it. So You know why? Because we had already read it. Yeah, I, I forgot about that. So, how could you see Edgeworth? Now just hold your horses for a sec. You hasty Yankee types never find a gal where I'm from. Defense attorneys have trouble with that as it is. Nobody loves me. <laughs> so once I was finished setting up my camera, I got back in my car. <laughs> oh boy! <laughs> your camera? Yeah. Got an automatic. The issue we are concerned with here is Miss Hart seeing Mr. Edgeworth. The camera has nothing to do with this at all. Objection sustained. Ah, he's not letting her answer any of my questions. This is far and calm away. Still, I brought my binoculars with me. Why do you have to look so angry while saying yeah. that? <laughs> binoculars? Yeah, binoculars. Yesterday, you mentioned that you were out looking for shooting stars, correct? Well, yeah. It was meteors. Wouldn't you need a telescope, not binoculars, for that? Uh. I've got doubts about your camera, too. Was that really to take pictures of meteor showers? <laughs> the camera is irrelevant to this case. You can't say that for certain. Hmm, Mr. Wright? Is the camera really relevant to this case? If you believe it is, you may continue with this line of questioning. But know this! If you find nothing with this, there will be consequences. Yeah, sure. Well, Mr. Wright, do you wish to press fervor about the camera? Press fervor or back off! You say we should press fervor? Yeah! This is make it or break it time. The camera is of the utmost importance, Your Honor. It is perhaps the key to this entire case. I don't know about that. Therefore, I will continue my line of questioning. Wow, maybe I went a little overboard there. Well, I thought he was going to say you sounded good. Very well. Miss Hart, you will testify to the court about the camera. Yeah, yeah, I hear you. Camera was set up to take pictures of a meteor shower. Miss Hart, what made you choose that lake to photograph meteors? You know the fog gets thick on that lake. It's not very suited for stargazing. Yeah, well, you see, I... I guess I wasn't thinking too straight. Huh! Mr. Wright, I will not have you badgering my witness because of her challenged intellect! <laughs> <laughs> now, wait a minute! <laughs> Continue your testimony. You were saying how it was... that. <laughs> I'm perfect, you know. <laughs> you were saying how it was that you saw Mr. Edgeworth... No unnecessary comments, please. Von Karm is very deep. <laughs> when I heard that noise out on the lake, I looked with my binoculars. If there was a heavy fog, how would binoculars change that at all? What do you mean? Even binoculars can't see through fog. But you say you clearly saw him? Uh, I did. Yeah. Enough! There is no room for doubt in her testimony. Uh... <laughs> um, she sounded pretty doubtful to me. But I have to find a clear contradiction first. I don't care how many Von Karmic objections I get. Objection! I'm going to find a hole in this testimony if it's the last thing I do. Objection! You're right! It was a cold night and the mist was thick as grit. Blah 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 blah. So, do you see where the contradiction lies? Um... Camera was set up... Wait, go back. Finished setting up the camera, she got back in the car, so she was in the car camping. That's the way to camp. <laughs> yeah. Well, it's Not better really. than it's better than camping in a tent. Like what if in the rains? rain with mosquitoes Ugh. in someone's backyard? Ugh. Well, it's not a backyard. It's right next to a no camping site. 
But this isn't our old church father son camp out. Oh. Well, I never went to those because I was yeah. neither a father nor a son, nor a man nor a boy. Sure. Uh, you were I, not a man. I was <laughs> not a man. That's right. <laughs> Uh, when I heard That's... that noise out on the lake, I looked with my binoculars inside the car. Did your car have any windows? It was kind of dented. No, it, it still had, it win- still had you windows. Need to- How okay. can you drive a car with okay. no okay. windows? You can't see out of it. Okay, true. But I was saying, like, out of the way, y'all. No, but I'm trying to think, like, where her car was p- positioned, could she have seen it? All she'd have to do high. is look out the window. Or like, like, oh boy, she, me and my binoculars. She, she may have gotten out of the car. But Okay. We have that. Do- Oh yeah, I forgot we actually got penalized at one point. Uh, cameras. Oh, that was it. Yeah. Got back. It's, it's four statements. Oh gosh. Mist was thick as grits. Cold night. It was cold out. Oh, actually, hang on. We forgot to back off. What? We have to go all the way back here. Okay, Your Honor, I withdraw my question. I have to remember who I'm dealing with. I bet Von Karma wants to trap me so he can put me in contempt. I think I'll hang back for now and see what happens. Oh, that was not really worth it. Ha! <laughs> No, that was not worth no, it. No, that was definitely not worth it. Alright. Sorry. Let's go back through here. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's the, the key to the entire case. <gasps> what? Mr. Wright's famous for buffing, apparently. You very well. I'm sorry. You just find the cord off camera. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Alright, now we've got everything. Huh. Alright. I have literally no idea. Can we, wait. Let's look at look the at evidence. Look at the evidence. Thanks. Alright. Not our attorney's ever edge. Oh, but I like the attorney's badge. Wait, Wait went um, to her camera. I literally could not stop. <laughs> like, I, I let go yeah. of my that's mouse, what happened. but it's okay, still That's what happened to your going. Wii U gamepad. I would like, I was trying to do Wii Fit one day, and it was just like, <laughs> and like, would what not stop. What were you doing on Wii Fit? Well, I was trying to select my exercise with the gamepad. It's, it wasn't one of those Mario Party 1 rotate the control stick as fast no, as you can. No, this is okay. freaking Wii Fit. You have to use your own body. Hang your thumb is part of your body. Okay, no. <laughs> what a um, workout. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, uh, says so automatic will take a picture. When loud noises are detected. Okay. A- apparently she's like, meteor shower. She had to go... <laughs> 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 yeah! That sounds like her, though. Uh, yeah, whatever. Time of death. Taken at 12.15. Why do we have that thing, anyway? Whatever. Uh, Grossberg gave it to us, which cool. was kind of weird. Article about monster... Overhead map. Let's look at the overhead map. Do, There's her car. Do. There's the lake. Boats. Larry's hot dog stand. Oh boy. <laughs> or I'm sorry, oh boy. samurai dog stand. She got. How the heck did her car get up there? She's like. <laughs> <laughs> like it looks. No so one could rickety. see where you were pointing. <laughs> okay, well, true. I was pointing at the path. Anyway, yeah. um. Oh man. Pistol. Boy, and pistol. <laughs> Maybe she had her own pistol to fire. <laughs> no, okay, no, no. Well, okay, but think about it. If her camera only goes off by loud noises, she isn't loud. She might be loud enough to trigger it, but she's not loud enough to be like, oh man, the meteor's here. I, like, she's so like, are you saying that she shot the guy and then the pistol she fired triggered her own camera? <laughs> sure. Well, or, or something where she's like, oh man, I bet there's a meteor shower. And then, like, the the bullet just happened to hit the guy. I don't know. I'm trying to think of what. That's might your happen. best theory. Okay. There's not that many good theories with this. Because there were just two guys on the boat. One was the dead well, guy, okay, and the other was. But I still think. I still think that maybe. Okay. This There's is my. The... This is my other thought. Someone is in the Loch Ness monster suit or Gordy or whatever with a gun. Gordy just comes out of the water with a gun, like Shazam! And then goes back to the depths <laughs> goes of back Loch Ness. To the depth of... Yes. <laughs> This is why the Loch Ness monster has never been sighted because it keeps killing everyone. Anyway, <laughs> <laughs> and then runs off with the evidence. Yeah, that's right. So I have literally no idea. All right, do you have like any even guesses? I mean, the guesses that I've had were like the car windows and stuff. So we all know how that went. <laughs> um, I mean, we haven't tried that. <laughs> you got do, back, you, do you think it is? She got to do back the in the car. I thought that her car wasn't facing properly. Okay. I don't know. That like Well, if we look at the overhead map. Like it's her not. Is, I mean her car's not. It'd be weird. Facing the wall. Do, do we also, try that. Is this like a camper car or is this like no, I it's drove just in my her car S- and it's I'm her sitting, SUV. Okay. I wasn't sure if it was like camper car, she's lounging in the back and then all of a sudden there's like a gunshot. 
It was, she actually did a drive-by shooting. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> she set up the camera, then did a drive-by shooting in a boat. <laughs> and because it was Christmas Day, like in the middle of the night, no okay, one was around. That's the other thing. What what prompted Law to be like, oh man, it's Christmas night? You know what that means? I gotta go camping in my truck or whatever. Lada doesn't have family, so it's, it's a tough time. Okay, we don't know if she has family or not. For all we know, she can have a loving, supporting group of family and friends that love her, and she's just like, nah, screw this, I'm gonna go camping in my SUV. <laughs> Lada's, Lada's an introvert. She needs her own time in the woods in the middle of the oh, night right. on Christmas <laughs> near a murder scene. <laughs> so yeah, I think that's suspicious. But I don't really know what that would mean. So Do you want to try it, though? I'm going to fail it, but sure. Okay. Yeah. This evidence clearly reveals the contradiction in that statement, Your Honor. How exactly are that evidence in the statement just now related? They aren't, are they? Not at all. Mr. Wright, please think the facts over before making accusations. No! I don't think that won me any points with the judge. <laughs> no, it actually lost you a point. Wait, are we not going to go back? What if we fail? Then what we get to see the game over screen, which we no! haven't actually seen. No, I don't want to fail. <laughs> <sighs> well, if you're afraid to fail, you will never okay. succeed. Well, that's true. That's true. <laughs> Words of wisdom by Artie here. Okay. Um... I'm what stroking my beard right now that it, I don't have. I was about to say, I'm like, you don't have a beard! <laughs> they don't know that. That's true. <laughs> you just said words of wisdom, so I'm picturing the old guy with the huge beard. The old guy with the huge beard. I'm thinking, like, Yen Sid Confucius here. Confucius say. Camera was set up, yeah. When I heard the noise, I looked with my binoculars in her car. She's like, wait. <laughs> wait, do binoculars work in a car? Only if you take the caps off the ends. Well, no, I I didn't know if it was, like, the glass on the glass, like, reflected weirdly and it wouldn't work. No, I don't think that's the case. Okay. Uh, she couldn't have seen, she couldn't have seen it with binoculars with the fog. But I don't know. She couldn't see it with the fog there? Yeah. Do you want to present the foggy photo again, then? Yes? Nope. Dang it. Your Honor, what do you think about the witness's statement? Uh, uh I'm not sure I follow. It clearly it contradicts the. Uh, I thought. I wish you could just write. You don't sound very convinced, this, Mr. Wright. This is the problem. Objection yeah. overruled. Ugh. I don't think that won me any points for the judge. No kidding. The judge is just like freaking, freaking right. The nice thing is, at the end of the trial period, I think we get all our exclamation points back. Let's uh, go back. No. Uh. Uh. I don't know what to do! Go back again. No, go back. Cold night, and the mist was thick, thick as, as grits. grits. Grits are, are grits thick? I don't I've think... never had grits. Okay, maybe it's this photo that we need to do. This is where you think we need the photo? <laughs> but it, but the photo shows that it was really foggy. But so apparently it doesn't work. Or before. I don't know, I, I just take it. Okay, um, I, well, I know what the contradiction is. Ah, but I don't! I know, this is why you've got to figure it out. I'm terrible at this game. Anyway, uh, like, sure, first one. First one, uh, present. Foggy photo? Uh, just something. Uh, let's see. <laughs> Not the attorney's badge. <laughs> well, obviously. I'm still Cold waiting night. for a game where the final piece of evidence you have to present is your attorney's okay. badge. Okay, <laughs> do cameras freeze? What? I'm thinking, like, Harry Potter here. You know how, like... The kid took oh, the like photo so and then he got, it. it's so cold that the camera, fro like, the film froze. I don't think that happens. I don't think that happens either. <laughs> but I immediately had, like, what's the name of that kid Colin from the second? Creevy. Colin Creevy. Colin Creevy, where he's like, ugh, and then he's, like, frozen okay, and but paralyzed. He got petrified and his film got burned up because, yeah, yeah. uh, spoiler alert, yeah. the basilisk in the castle. Not everyone knows that. Even people who haven't if seen If you haven't it, read haven't Harry Potter 2... No. Harry Potter 2! It's a, it's a, that would be like spoiling Ocarina of Time. It's, if you haven't played Ocarina of Time by this or point, Star Wars. I don't think you're interested I think it's more in like playing Star Wars. Ocarina of anyway. Time. Um, not, the, not the camera. No. That contradicts the autopsy mm, before. <laughs> maybe. Next one. No. 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 That means this has to be a yes. <laughs> uh, it was thick as grits. No, it wasn't. There was a pistol. <laughs> no. That was actually so I guess a it has fog to be. Though. I guess it has to be the, the photo. Sure. Try the photo. Um, the lake photo? Yeah. No! Why is this so bad? The 
witness's statement is clearly faulty, Your Honor. I'm sorry, but I could see nothing faulty. Yes, you can! You just gotta think! Unfortunately, I will have to penalize you, Mr. Wright. With your stupid brain! Uh, I must be on the wrong track? What are you, stupid head? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Nani. <laughs> I have no idea, dude. Seriously, just, you really like, have. I, I you really have no. And I feel stupid for saying that because probably everyone's like, "This is like Dora the Explorer," where they're like, "Behind you, behind you, <laughs> behind you, <laughs> behind you." <laughs> but I, I don't. All right. Well. Finish setting up the camera. The camera. Let's save just so that way. Are you gonna fail on purpose? I want to show off the game over. I. No. It's not like a is depressing it... game over. It's not like the Banjo Kazooie game over. Or like, <laughs> what is it? Diddy Kong. Uh, the Donkey Kong Country 2. <laughs> yeah. Oh no. Your Honor, what do you think about the witness's statement? Uh, uh, I'm not sure I follow. Uh, have we already been over this before, Your Honor? Yes, we have. I believe that you are finished here, Mr. Wright. I don't think that one made any points with the judge. This court sees no reason to further prolong the trial. Nor is there any need for more time to decide the case against the defendant. Oh boy. This case is extremely clear. I see no room for misinterpretation of the facts. This court finds the defendant, Mr. Miles Edgeworth, guilty. The end screen is literally just Edgeworth, like, choking Miles, uh, choking him to death. Like, <laughs> The accused will surrender to the court immediately, to be held pending trial at a higher court within a month from today's date. Huh? That is all. The court is adjourned. What is that? Oh, poor dude! He's just like... Huh? Oh, that's it? Yeah. <laughs> that was really lame. <laughs> Alright, fine. Martin. So you, you literally have no clue whatsoever? Alright. So the, she's like, the camera was set to take pictures of a meteor shower. Okay. But if you look at the camera, it's pointing the lake. It's not even looking up at the sky. Okay, well, meteors could maybe be shown over the lake? I don't know. I did not think about that at you all. You were photographing <laughs> shooting stars? That's a lie! I saw the camera you set up yesterday. It was pointed directly at the lake. You have to point a camera upwards to take photos of the stars, Miss Hart. Ugh! Well, I like this music, so that's good. Mr. Wright, what are you driving at? The witness was not at the lake to photograph shooting stars, Your Honor. <laughs> well, well then, what exactly was she photographing? Show evidence or I don't know. I mean, I don't know. Okay, well, so... let's be honest then. Well, that I don't know. <laughs> what the witness takes photos of is entirely her business. This has nothing to do with this case. Yup, I bet ya. Not to mention that you can't even show us another reason why she might have been there. Mr. Wright, yes, if you are out of material, I suggest we end this mockery of a cross-examination. Uh-oh, I can't let the trial end like this. I have to show them something. Your Honor, take a look at this. What was Miss Hart trying to photograph at the lake? Do you know? My attorney's badge! No, um... She was trying to take a Misty, a photo of Misty Face phone! <laughs> no, she was trying to photograph the Gordy dude. The Hopefully Gordy dude? has to be. Oh, hang on. What happens if we say the wrong thing here? <laughs> My attorney's badge! Well, Your Honor, what do you think? I think I'm confused. Wrong again, Mr. Wright. So very wrong. Ugh, you can't get through smile. this one with your weak bluffs. Are you a part-time clown? Your, your Honor, you're creepy. enough playing around. Here's the real evidence. Enough playing around is my line, Mr. Wright. And we're dead. <laughs> Alright, so you said it was of Gordy? Gordy. Miss Hart, this is what you were trying to photograph. What's this? A newspaper article? Gordy? Ah, oh, the sighting at Gordy Lake. Well, Miss Hart. Uh, I never heard no lake monster. You got proof or something? Let's see you prove that I was down at the lake trying to photograph this Gordy. I don't have proof, or I have proof. <laughs> uh, I mean, we have to have proof. What? Oh. Well, I don't have Pretty proof. proof. Bah! Your ineptitude is entertaining, Mr. Wright, but enough is enough. I've had enough of baseless claims made without a hair of evidence to support them. Well, alright, if that's how you want to play, I'll show you evidence. Mr. Wright, are you sure about this? I'm sure sick of that smarmy prosecutor putting me down. Oh yeah. Or did he taunt me so I would get mad and make a mistake? Very well, let's see it. And no joking around this time, please. Okay. I have it. Proof. Hmm, 
intriguing. Very well, let's see it. And no joking around this time, please. Here is proof that the witness was trying to photograph Gordy the Lake Bob. Mm -hmm. I think that's supposed to be Phoenix saying that. Come on, you know I have to do it. Oh. <laughs> Here is my proof. It's simple. I'm a defense attorney. <laughs> If it's simple, then why have you obviously made an error, Mr. Wright? What's that? Go home. Consider a career change. Whoa! Gah! How can they so casually toss aside this out Oh, wait. Oops. Wrong evidence. <laughs> 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 Proof she was trying to film the monster would be, uh... We use the camera, we use the article... Automatically take pictures when loud noises detected. Maybe she was trying to do it so that way when like the monster would appear, it'd be like, Whoa! and then it'd be like, take the picture. What's the, what's the article say? I mean, nothing that we can read. Yeah, pretty okay. much. Um. So do you think that's it, the camera then? Uh, otherwise, I don't really know. Nope. The proof, Miss Hart, is your own camera. Oh, maybe it is. <gasps> Your camera was set to take photos in response to loud noises, correct? Thus, this photograph here, taken when a gun fired on the lake. <laughs> and here, this article about Gordy. According to this article, Gordy made a loud noise when it emerged. But we couldn't read that, so... Well, you were trying to photograph Gordy, weren't you? That's why you had to set your camera in response to loud noises. I like how confident she still is, though. With her stance. <laughs> yeah. Order, order. I see. I too thought it was a little strange. Why didn't you blow yeah, it up? sure. Well, Miss Hart, you were camping there to try and take a photo of Gordy, weren't you? Yeah. Not bad. Are you all lawyers that smart? So smart, boy. I was down there trying to photograph Gordy. You got me. So what? Huh? That don't change what I saw, does it? Oh, uh, yes it does. Exactly! What you just used several precious minutes of our time to prove is nothing more than this witness is an idiot who thinks monsters exist. H hey! But as she so succinctly said, so what? It changes nothing. Not true. You were hiding this whole thing about Gordy for some reason, I know it. But what could it have been? Whatever it is, I'm getting to the bottom of this. Someone is Gordy in a costume, and he <laughs> shot them! It's so simple! <laughs> <laughs> Marty is convinced of this. Miss Hart, why did you hide the fact that you were searching for Gordy from the court? Uh, Please revise your testimony. Because I already uh, committed a crime by camping at the campsite. <laughs> <laughs> That's true! She was not supposed to be there. Right, fine. I'll testify. It won't change nothing, though. Something will change. It has to. And I'm going to spot it. I really could use a smoke. <laughs> Let me change my stance so I'm uh, confused in the anime. What is new testimony? Actually, I'm not a research student at a university. I'm an investigative photographer. Imagine what a scoop it'd be if I got a picture of that monster. That's why I'm camping out by the lake. But that's all I was hiding. When I heard the bang, I looked straight out at the lake. There wasn't much else to look at, so I just watched that bow for the whole time. Then I saw a flash near one of the men's hands, and I heard a gunshot. I was looking right at the boat the whole time, cross my heart, and hope to fry. <laughs> <laughs> that was a long one. I did not want to eat fried hmm. Lada's heart. Ew. Ugh, well, Augustus-flavored chocolate-coated goop. Ew. No one would buy that it. <laughs> well, Mr. Wright, you may cross-examine the witness. Well, I've heard no one say, cross my heart and I hope to fry. <laughs> the witness's testimony is unchanged from before. Whether she is a research student or a photographer is no bearing on this case. There is no need to waste more of our time with another pointless cross-examination. Oh, yeah. Uh, hmm. hmm. Well, guess what? It's my right! I claim the defense's right to cross-examine the witness, Your Honor. Von Karma's up to something, I know it. He doesn't want me to cross-examine her because... Why? Was there a contradiction? contradiction? In red text. <gasps> Anime gasp. Very well. You may begin the cross-examination. Anime gasp is like... <gasps> <laughs> you seem sure of yourself. You must have something in mind. Ha! Huh, that would be a first. What do you mean? I just... <laughs> <laughs> Very funny. You understand that this is your last chance at a cross-examination, Mr. Wright? Is it? If there is no problem with the testimony this time, we will let the witness leave. 
I, I will announce my verdict at that time, Mr. Wright. You Understood? Die. Yes, Your Honor. Cross my heart and I hope to fry. And I'm so evil. Look at my eyes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not a reason. Hold it! What university did you not go to? <laughs> what the what manner of person are you? I'm not sure what high fault was Falut falutin. falutin enough to be called a manner of anything. <laughs> I don't know, you're a person. Investigative photographer. An investigative photographer? Yeah. You get your photo and sell it to the press. It's that kind of business. Hey, I was taking pictures at my sister's graduation last year. <laughs> now guess what? Um, what? There was a UFO just hanging in the sky! What's a UFO? A UFO? UFO? You know, an unidentified flying object. A UFO! That's when I had a sort of revelation. I knew I should become an investigative photographer. Uh, I see. Kind of a shaky basis for a career. Oh, Saw Phoenix! A UFO. <laughs> Imagine what a UFO. would be if I got a picture of that monster. More like a Frito scoop? <laughs> oh, Frito scoops are amazing. They are great. Is Gordy really all that newsworthy? Heck yeah! They even had him up on TV. I'm not sure that, that appearing on the local news rumor of the month show qualifies. That's more than she's doing. <laughs> Last month's show was Bigfoot sighted on Acorn Hill, I believe. Hey, they also had a picture of him in the newspaper. For real. Mr. Wright, this is one fight I do not believe you can win. Let's keep moving, shall we? Yes, Your Honor. That's why I was camping out by the lake. <laughs> why did you choose that specific spot? That's why you put the automatic sensor on your camera? Yeah. Borrowed it from a friend at the university. Except you weren't at the university! She said a university. Oh, okay. She has she friends who went to college. <laughs> she realizes every sound it picks up, and when it gets a bang... It snaps a shot. Actually, more like 12. Yeah. <laughs> so how many pictures have it taken so far? Uh, the only time the camera trigger was that night. Hmm. That's weird. <laughs> That's all I was hiding. It's not like somebody just, like, throws firecrackers near your camera all the time. I think it's time you told us why you felt you had to hide your true purpose at the lake. Heck, if word got out what I was up to, the lake would be swarming with competitors. Competitors? Yeah! Second-rate shutterbugs trying to steal my scoop. Ah. Is that the only reason you were hiding the truth? Well, I was also camping there illegally. <laughs> <laughs> well, actually... Actually, I was told not to talk because this guy is being a jerk. <laughs> Mr. Wright, I will not have you asking questions with no relevance to this case. Whatever you say, Von Karma, I know you told her to keep quiet. He's even worse when than When I heard the bang, I looked right up at the sky. Not the sky, the lake. <laughs> exactly what sort of sound was it? Well, I've never heard one before, so I can't say for sure, but it sounded like a gunshot. It was a lot sharper sound than I would have expected. Hmm... Turns out it was just Larry Butts like, Happy Christmas! <laughs> <laughs> He's also apparently British, because British people say Happy Christmas. <laughs> there wasn't much else to look at? Yep. I don't know. If she heard a bane and she thought Gordy was out there, I kind of doubt she'd waste any time looking at a boat. What? What did I do now? What are you giving me that look for? Definitely suspicious. Maybe it's time for some evidence? Witness, continue. Hold your hush puppets, Pops. I'm getting there. Then I saw a flash near one of the man's hands. Was there nothing on the lake but that boat at the time? Huh? Wait, so you're thinking maybe he was shot from some other place? I don't think so, nope. Unless it was Gordy! The lake was <laughs> smooth as glass. <laughs> hmm... I better find some sort of contradiction in this testimony. This is almost better than when I was like, okay, it's gotta be like Vaughn, or I can't, Vasquez and Penny stacked on top of each other in the suit. Like, <laughs> I won't be able to beat Von Karma any other way. There has to be something. I still like your theory of Salmono, just do it and you streak. <laughs> oh, wait, shoot, we just repeated this. <laughs> well, uh, thank goodness that's the short one. <laughs> Um, was nothing, wasn't much else to look at, so I watched the boat the whole time. Then I saw a flash near one of the men's hands and heard another gunshot. Her bang looked straight out at the lake. Hmm. 
<laughs> How are you supposed to read that? It's like he guessed what? Well, look at that. This is a for the DS. The screens are tiny. <laughs> yeah, and then before that, the Game Boy Advance. Yeah. Which is even smaller in a way. Unless you have the Game Boy Player. Um, bang out at the lake. Uh, pistol. Pistol bullets. Fired three what, times. What does the twenty-two caliber mean? Like, how fast does it shoot? I don't know. Okay, because that might be part of it. I don't know. A flash? Maybe they were like partying. Yeehaw! Hey, look at you! Okay. Edgeworth partying? No, You're not right. Him. I'm talking about the other dude. Maybe. Okay. Maybe this is like the most far-fetched thing ever. Because they had the whole thing with Maya and the firecracker, like, yahoo! Probably to show off how, like, it can sound like a bang. So maybe one of the guys was like, hey, it's a worthless party. Woohoo! And then he thought it was a gun, and he was like, Psh! And he's like, no! Psh! And then he it missed, and then the other guy shot <laughs> and then him. Gordy and then Gordy came up and killed him. <laughs> Gordy yeah. came up and killed him! Okay. Was, they were partying, man. I don't, I don't know. I, so, if I'm being honest, I actually don't remember where the contradiction is here. So oh, that's no. fun. We got to save. Did you save beforehand? I have save states. <laughs> Caused one bullet shot to the heart. Edgeworth did not shoot the dude, as far as we know. So, the two things that I'm noticing are... Weapon was fired three times. She's only testified about two gunshots. Okay, that's true. And also, there are two gunshots. The guy only died to a single bullet wound. Well, that's why I was like, maybe Edge, maybe she was like, Woohoo! Kid, take a picture! And then the other guy was like, ah! And then there's Gordy came in and shot them too. <laughs> maybe she had a gun to fire off her gun. Or, to fire off... She had a gun to fire her gun. I thank goodness I have a gun to fire my gun. <laughs> Maybe she had a gun to fire off the camera, and then the camera took a picture, and then the guy shot off the firecracker, and then Are he you? came up and shot them. This is the most far fetched movie ever, and yet it would not be at all I out of place you, in a Phoenix I told you I love screen. <laughs> or in a Leighton game, really. Leighton just thing. has, like, ridiculously convoluted plot twists. Gordy has person in it. I'm still convinced. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's your theory. <laughs> um, I don't know where... I, so I are have... you saying Lada had a gun of her own, and she fired it just to get the camera to take a photo? She didn't actually manually press the button. She's just like, no, it's well, automatic! You gotta fire the gun to make the picture! It's so, okay, one, we've already established this girl's not the brightest bulb. So she was probably like, I gotta get this camera to go off. It's dark. You may not be able to see the picture. So she's like, hey, I got this gun here in my car. Alright. Uh, no, but I, I just thought, I don't know. Do we want to just try the, it was free shots? Sure. Okay. Oh, nope. That was not it. <laughs> he was about to slam. <laughs> um. Bang, bang. Okay, that's the one where he's like, maybe I should present evidence on. Maybe present the gun there. I don't think it'll be the gun. It's not the topsy report. Who's Robert? The topsy I just, report. I just realized. Robert that. Hammond, did he lose the victim? Oh. Wait, where have I heard that name? He was the victim. No, but... Robert Hammond. Yeah, I heard it from a previous case, I thought. Anyway. Nope. Um, the ballistic markings. It's, it's funny, the gun's know. fingerprints. Uh, I heard bang. Do we just want to see, like, she wouldn't have looked at the boat, she would have looked at Gordy. Sure. Oh, that worked. Miss Hart, were you really looking at the boat? What's with you? Of course I was looking at it. I was the only thing out there! Any normal person be looking at it! I agree. Any normal person would. But you're not normal. <laughs> but you are far from normal! <laughs> what?! You all wanna step over here and say that?! You were camping at the lake to take a picture of Gordy. That's pretty weird. Think about it. What would you do if you heard a loud noise? You'd be scanning the lake for any sign of Gordy, that's what. You wouldn't give the boat a second thought! Order! Continue, Mr. Wright. You testified that you were watching the boat through binoculars. However, you wouldn't need binoculars to watch that boat. You needed them to search for Gordy, and that's what you were doing. I love how she's just kind well. of like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, now that y'all mention it, I did sort of take my binoculars and kind of scan the lake a bit. I mean, Gordy might be out there, you know? Miss Hart, are you saying that you were not watching the boat then? Sorry, y'all. I 
wasn't fibbing, really. I was just, I thought, you know, I could be a witness for a murder and all. I kind of got excited. I was sure I'd be watching that boat till now. This, this is totally uncalled for. But, but hey, you got the photograph, you got proof. Hmm, still we can't see who's shooting who in this. Right, right. That's why I took this photo and... Witness, that's enough. No. You've had a long you day. Shut, up. shut your pie hole. <laughs> Sh shut my what? What was she going to say? She took the photo and and what? Wait a second. She even had a photograph to prove it. She's gonna enlarge. But you it. really can't yeah. tell the fo from the photo who's shooting. That's why she said she's going to enlarge the photo. She said it'll drop the quality down a mite, but it'll let us see who's who. She enlarged that photo. Why won't Von Karma let her show it? Because obviously it would show everything. I've got a hunch. I bet that enlarged photo shows something bad for Von Karma. This is my chance. If I'm wrong, though, it'll mean prison for Edgeworth, or worse. You're what not should wrong. I do? Go. Make her show the enlargement. <laughs> well, let's just wait and see what happens. You're I'm an idiot. <laughs> if this is a trap, I'd better hold back and see how things go. But if I wait now, the cross examination will be over. Can I really risk that? Do nothing. <laughs> Wait, there's a second one? <laughs> well. This hereby ends the cross-examination of Miss Vada Hart. And none too soon. That was a flagrant waste of my time. Mr. Von Karma, do you have anything to add? No. I stated everything I needed to when this trial began. Decisive evidence, a decisive witness. What else could possibly be required? Nothing, of course. Oh no! I shouldn't have pressed further! further. <laughs> this court sees no reason to further prolong the trial, nor is there Go any back. need for more time to decide the case again. Oh, is this just an in instant game over? Yeah. Oh, it is! <laughs> I have to fight now or I could lose everything! <laughs> now we go back here. <laughs> the same thing. <laughs> Miss Hart, look at the photograph. You enlarged this photograph, did you not? Uh, yeah, I did. Why has that enlargement not been presented to the court? B because it does not exist. What are you all talking about? You were the one who told me not to show it in court in the first place. You old fool. Oh, okay, Von can Von Karma go to prison for that? Because he's like, he's yeah. actively hiding evidence. What is the meaning of this, Mr. Von Karma? Miss mm. Hart, show the photo to the court. Show us the enlargement. Uh, how about you go to jail? <laughs> the prosecution objects to the submission of this evidence. Objection denied. The witness will show the enlargement to the court. Here it is. Uh... Hmm, we still cannot see who is firing in this. But everyone's there. It, it could silent. be the defendant, or maybe it's not. Regardless, I'll accept this as evidence. Like photo Hold added on, to the court look. record. Can we look at it? Um... No, we can't. Happy now, Mr. Wright? Yes, extremely. Okay, hold on. We can check based on who's wearing the stylish... No, they were both wearing raincoats, because... No, no, the stylish Edgeworth... Cravat? Cur yeah. You can't see a cravat. Exactly, so one. it's not that dude, because this dude almost has a beard. Well, well no, no, because the coat is blocking where the cravat would be anyways. No, you would not wear the cravat on the inside of a coat. Who would do that? Edgeworth, he, we saw from the beginning he had the coat on over his styling stuff. No, he didn't. He okay. did. Okay, well... <laughs> that is not the important part. <laughs> Happy now, Mr. Wright? Um, there has to be something... You asked for the enlargement, you got the enlargement. And little good it has done for any of us. That's why I requested she not show it. Hmm. I suppose this means that the cross-examination is over, obviously. But wait, I want to talk more. Then I'd like to close the cross-examination of Miss Vada Hart. And none too soon. That was a flagrant waste of my time. No. I gotta take a smoke break. How else do you think I got this deep voice? <laughs> Mr. Von Karma, do you have anything to add? I stated everything I needed to when this trial began. Decisive evidence, a decisive witness. What else could possibly be required? Nothing, of course. 
Then I believe it is time for me to declare my verdict. Wait, it's not supposed to go like this. There has to be a clue in this photo, somewhere. This is bad. Real bad. What should I do? Speak up. Object to the of object to the enlargement, show other evidence, or wait and see. Okay, if we wait and see, it's over. If so, so wait... obviously we gotta try that first. Uh-oh. Think of something? No good. I guess I'll just sit back and see how things turned out. Nope. Very well. Allow me to state my verdict. Oh no! I should have pressed further! <laughs> Alright. Um, should we object to the enlargement or should okay, we show it? We evidence? have literally no other evidence to be like, Ha! Huh, this is a 20 ca 22 caliber, which means the Gordy had to shoot it, not this guy. <laughs> like, we don't have anything. You are so dead set on Gordy being the one who killed okay. him. Okay. <laughs> there, there is no way this Gordy exists. It's either, it's either he doesn't exist, and it's just like, oh, this is a stupid press thing, which could be. Or it's like, no, someone's in this Gordy costume, making this big scene, so all these people can be it's around. It's Larry. It's Larry! The Larry did it to get more publicity for his super idol! His supermodel girlfriend, whatever, could be like, oh, you totally need to have this You go, girlfriend! Yeah, you totally need to have this stupid Loch Ness monster outfit, and he's like, yes, I could make millions! <laughs> can you not see him doing that? The real mastermind is Keyonce! <laughs> Man. Not Beyonce, Keyonce. Yeah, object. Your Honor, there is something decidedly strange with this enlargement. What, what might that be? Mr. Wright, you will show the court what you mean. What about this photo is strange? Okay, here goes nothing. I'll show the judge what's strange about this photo. Everyone's standing up on the boat. Nice! <laughs> 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 you have tipped over! Do you want to try that? <laughs> <laughs> They're standing on the boat. <laughs> we can't write that in though, because it's just showing what's weird about the photo. Okay. I mean, we can present their feet up, hold and up. do that. I, I've never shot a gun before, so I don't really know. Have you shot a gun before? Uh, like, I've shot a Nerf gun. A Nerf gun? Okay. Have you seen an actual gun shot before? Not. Okay. In real Does life. Does it make a light? Yeah. Okay. I didn't. Know. Um. Because otherwise, I was like, it's that weird. Light. <laughs> yeah, that's actually a flamethrower. <laughs> Hang on, I actually want to try the whole... <laughs> they're standing up in the boat. Here, Your Honor. Where? Mr. Wright, I understand you're in a tight spot. However, you have nothing to gain by making baseless claims of faulty evidence. Are we just... <laughs> what, uh, do you want to try showing other evidence? Sure. W wait! Your Honor, this evidence... Who be like, you're an idiot. I believe we've spent enough time talking about evidence. Because I did all the time spent time talking. Hmm, indeed. What if that dude was- We've heard opinions on every piece of evidence but this enlargement. Hold up. What if- Hmm. What if the judge is like, oh man, I gotta cover everything up because he was there? <laughs> the you think the no, judge- No, not the judge. Never mind, not the judge. The, um, prosecution. Von Karma. And he's like, because he's super snazzy. What if Mr. Super Snazzy was like, I'm gonna shoot these people. And then they were like, no way. <laughs> he was in the Gordy costume. <laughs> maybe he was. No, but like, maybe he was. And then he was like, oh shoot, I gotta cover up like everything. I gotta cover up Gordy. I gotta cover up this gunshot. I gotta cover up this enlarged photo that might show my beautiful face. Like, all these things. <laughs> okay, very interesting. <laughs> I don't know. It's probably like super simple or super complicated. And I, don't know. I see no point in retracting our steps. Retracing. This is bad. Real bad. Oh, okay. Then we can go back here. Oh, we can't even look at our evidence from the, this no, part. Oh, man. that stinks. That's gonna be it's almost impossible. That's gonna be almost impossible then for you to figure out the contradiction. Oh. Uh, okay, there's fog have, everywhere. If you have really good memory, Is maybe. there something behind it? It looks like the, it no. looks like Gordy's behind them. No. <laughs> it's, that's just you okay, seeing what you want to see. I still think see. them standing on the boat weird. Um, leg. 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 I already there. did it on the leg. Wait! This dude, he's reaching in his pocket for something. Oh, you think that's it? Maybe. Oh. Here, Your Honor. Where? <laughs> no, Mr. Wright, you're wrong. <laughs> Sorry. That was a good idea, though. Um... Is, is this guy bald? No. <laughs> Again, it's just fog. That guy has no face! No, it's just fog, Mr. Wright. <laughs> he's looking the other way at something, which could be Gordy. Um... What's with the light behind the other dude's head? I don't know. To, to the right of it. See that? Is that like his ear that's lit up? Or is that like something behind it? This? Right no, here? No, not that. That weird light. Oh, that? That's just shading from the gunshot. Okay. Okay, I'm guessing you're not going to figure it out, so... Okay. This guy, he's holding the gun in his left hand. Edgeworth's prints are from his right hand. What? That's so 
dumb. That is really hard. Here, Your Honor. The I shooter? I've never been able to figure that out. I'm not sure I understand. What about the shooter is strange? Look at the hand holding the pistol, Your Honor. The hand? That hand directly contradicts another piece of evidence. This man's left hand does what? Let me show you. I'll show you the evidence that left hand contradicts my attorney's badge! <laughs> I'm not sure this warrants a take that. <laughs> I better think this one through. Mr. Wright, please hurry up! We haven't got all day! <laughs> yes, Your Honor. Right away. <laughs> Yeah, if you go... It, it was dumb we couldn't look at the evidence That's from the dumb, photo. That's dumb, because I think if we could have looked at the they evidence, fixed that I would have been future able to figure it out. Yeah, you, we can, they fixed that in future games. So yeah, Barris Edgeworth's right hand. I would have been able to figure it out. The least. evidence is clear. The man in this photograph is holding that pistol in his left hand. However, the prints on the murder weapon were from Edgeworth's right hand. Ergo, the man shooting the pistol in this photograph is not Mr. Edgeworth. <laughs> Oh yeah, Maya Faye was banished. I forgot about yeah. that. I was like, why isn't she talking? Now that everyone in the courtroom is quieted down, I would like to reconvene this court of law. Mr. Wright? Yes, Your Honor? You have given us definitive proof today. We now know that it was not Mr. Edgeworth who fired the pistol that night. However, this leaves us with a rather large problem. If Mr. Edgeworth didn't do it, then who shot our victim? It was the prosecution! Precisely! As we have seen, there were no other people on the lake that night. Otherwise, it was, uh, Who but it. the defendant could have shot the victim? Gordy! Miss Hart, the victim himself, or Larry? Larry in Gordy's costume, obviously. Are you going with that? <laughs> I just want to see what happens. Wait, wait! I can't do that! Sacrifice one friend to save another? What's the point? Oh, good for you, Phoenix. Well, right, your answer. <laughs> Alright. Uh... <laughs> nice slow Let's down. try Miss Hart. Otherwise, it has to be the victim. Who else but the witness, Miss Vada Hart? W what? Do you have proof of this? <laughs> it's super slow down. Proof schmoof! Always with the proof! Oh, wait, I do need proof, don't I? <laughs> Mr. Wright, I'll have you remember this is a court of law. Dang, that would be really morbid. There's only one explanation remaining. The man who shot the victim was none other than the victim himself. Oh, I think the victim was just like, uh, and like shooting himself. Yeah. No, shooting himself. Yes, that's what we're suggesting. No, we were like, no, the victim who shot the gun was shooting at Edgeworth. That's what they're suggesting. Oh, yeah. I was thinking of just like, uh, well, I guess I'm gonna die tonight. That would be really bad. Well, that, oh. is, that is what we're suggesting. Order, order. So, you were saying that the victim committed suicide? Oh, yeah. Yes, Your Honor. I can think of no other explanation. Hmm. Indeed, that does seem to be the only remaining option. I am so very, very sorry, Mr. Wright. But suicide is out of the question. Uh, how? W what? An examination of the victim's wound reveals the distance at which he was shot. The could have distance? Like, held the gun before. The victim was clearly shot from further than a meter away. He just had lanky collar on. A that. meter? Th th that's free feet! Indeed, he is not Lanky Kong, so he couldn't have done it. There was no way it could have been suicide. Maybe he had one of those toy claw things. No, <laughs> no, maybe, no maybe he had a selfie stick. But with that the gun. Was, that was not in the photo, though. <laughs> order, no, order. That. Mr. Von Karma, are you, the, are you sure of the accuracy of your data? No. Of course! I have already considered the possibility of suicide, you see. The autopsy, autopsy report, report updated. updated. It's the updated autopsy report. Hmm, I see. Very well, allow me to state my opinion. Considering the situation, the shooter had to be the defendant, Mr. Edgeworth. However, the prints on the gun revealed that the shooter was not Mr. Edgeworth. This is a conundrum. Therefore, I would like to suspend proceedings for this trial for the day. Yay! The court orders the defense and the prosecution to further investigate this matter. Understood? Yes, Your Honor. Stupid Your Honor. <laughs> <laughs> that is all. This court is adjourned. Bah! Gotta get my smoke on. <laughs> Pretty much. December 26th, 1.15 p.m. RD. District Court, Defendant Lobby Number 2. Whew! That was a close one. Hey. Hey! Don't you have anything to say? No. I have yet to be declared innocent, right? Well, yeah, but... What happened out there on that lake anyway? If he didn't commit suicide, then who... 
The shooter was about a meter away, too. W what? Don't give me that look. I did not kill him. I did not. <laughs> I was just kidding around. Hmm. Look, I'm going to go and check on Maya. Oh, right. What? Tell her something for me. What? Tell... Tell her to watch what she says in court. That's all. Yeah, I'm sure she'll be happy to hear you say that, Edgeworth. Jerk. I'm sure he was gonna say something <laughs> nicer, but that didn't work. I requisitioned a transcript of Lada's entire testimony. I thought it might give me some ammunition for the trial tomorrow. Of course, she didn't see the shooter. So the only part of her testimony that stood was the bang she heard. Lana's deposition added to the court record. It's kind of like April May's. One sentence. To no! be continued. This I is a 50 to... minute episode! Okay, this could to... take four hours I wanted to, to hear say. from Maya. I wanted her to be like, thank goodness you're okay. Thank goodness that you're okay, I Deputy Wario. Shut up! <laughs> Anyhow, that's it for today. Thanks for watching. I'm Artie. And I'm Marty. Tune in next time. We'll be investigating more on checking up on Maya, who's now in prison. Oh, boy! So, Wait, why am I in prison? Uh, because you were held in contempt of the court. Oh, was? Yeah. Anyways. Objection! Tune in then. Have a great day and God bless.